All right, so I know you came here, you know, just to maybe learn about terrain, but I'm also going to show you, like, amazing, insane Sigma male, I don't know, what other word is there? Alpha, Chad, something like that, whatever. Terrain, like, ways to use terrain, right? So look, look, I know I know you're here, okay, you're wondering, how do I use terrain bite plugs? I'm, I'm a little, I'm a little stupid, okay? I'm not stupid, no, no, you're, um, what's the word? You're keen to learn, okay? And so you want to learn, and so you want to learn how to use terrain. Okay, yeah, yeah, no, I get that, I get that. Terrain editor, okay, over here. There's a little window, you click on that. Ignore this for now, okay? And we're going to go over this, but like, it's, it's, it's whatever, okay? This is where it's fun. Select, transform, fill, doesn't matter. Click on draw, right? You'll get, you're going to see this brush, this brush up here, okay? Add, you know, add, subtract. You probably understand what that means. Subtract will just remove any existing terrain. This will just change the shape of the thing. This will change the size. Very, very simple. Pivot is like, you see, you see, like, it's like where the center of the brush is, right? So right now it's in the center, so it's in the center, right? If the pivot is on the bottom, then it's gonna, then like this the sphere is gonna be like like I'm gonna be controlling the bottom of the sphere. Top is I'm controlling the top of the sphere, right? Usually I keep center plane lock. I'll be honest, no clue what that is. Uh, ignore water. Simply, if this is true, it just ignores any water. Ignore parts means that it ignores parts besides I believe the base plate. So the base plate base plate doesn't count. Um, and yeah, this is where you just pick material. So we got grass. So I can just do this. Look how cool that is, bro. Look how sick that is, right? And I can just keep keep on adding. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Isn't that just beautiful? What a piece of architecture. And then you can, you know, switch out materials and whatnot. Just add more, just sculpt, sculpt more like this. And then just control Z all of that to delete. Look at that. I mean, yeah, okay. It's gonna take some work. That's where that's where you use clear. Okay, clear will delete everything. But yeah, so we we got that. Okay, so we gotta draw. Let me, let me just draw a little bit, okay? A little bit. Sculpt, very simple. Sculpt just kind of erodes more land with your selected material. So if I wanted this part to be a little more icy, I would I would do this, right? So like it doesn't, like it adds it on top, but like slightly, you know, not too much. Like this. Smooth, just smooth, smooths it out. You know, you can change the base, the strength, right? You can, you can play around with these. I'm just kind of showing you the, the basics. Flatten, you know, just you, you select a plane and you just flatten it based on that plane, like so. Paint will just paint on uh, whatever material you select. So it doesn't add more mass. It just changes the way it looks, right? And then sea level, you have this box, basically, that you can move around. And anything that's air will be filled with water. Like so, right? So ba so basically the ground, right, is, isn't touched, right? So anything that, yeah, and then you can evaporate it. Evaporate, please... I don't even know what's going on anymore. I'm going to delete everything, okay? But yeah, so sea level is like, you basically just, you know, you have a box and then just, yeah, you, you can, that, that's how you basically like fill up oceans and everything, right? So now that you understand, and by the way, also, select, transform, and fill, um, that's all for this box, right? So you can fill it up with the ground, for example. There we go. And you'll, you'll just fill it up with a certain material, right? And then you can... And then you can subtract as well, right? So just remember that you you can do this. You can make it like this, right? Now, let's get to the fun part. Okay, let's get to the fun part of actually making something. All right. So let me let me show you. Okay, let me let me show you let me show you something fun, all right? Cuz th this is this is pretty dope. If let's say we have this basalt thing, right? Or no, let me let me add, right? Let me add. Boom, 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 boom. I don't know, something like that, right? And then maybe we will have like some I don't know, some, some water thing just on, on top over here. You know what you could do? You could make like a like a little smaller circle. Like a, a tad bit smaller, okay? Not by too much, but you know, a little bit. Subtract mode. And then you could just do that. Look at that. How cool is that? How cool is that? There we go. Right? Let me, let me just cancel that. Imagine playing a game with this sort of map. Like, imagine you're playing some, like, RPG, some survival game, right? And you're just, like, exploring this beautiful world. And it just looks like this. Like, you have this, like, water... Like, how cool does this look, man? Oh, goodness. That's amazing. Yeah, look at that. Okay, I, okay, look, look. I, I can see how this may look, you know, a little, a little weird. 
from a distance, okay? I understand. But when you're when you're if playing the game, who cares? It doesn't matter. You're not going to see it unless the game like fails to load or whatever and spawns you like midair. That sometimes might, might happen. <laughs> um, but yeah, yeah, and then, you know, you can just clear to that, you know. Just, I don't know. Just have, have fun with this, honestly, bro. Literally, salt. You can just have salt. Like, what? You, you know what I mean? Look at that. Cubes of salt. And then you can subtract those cubes of salt. Like so. There we go. Look at this. Abstract art. Right, right thing. We've just created an abstract map. Like, look at that. You can... Yeah, there we go. You can, like, make, like, another, like, overused, crappy, oh, scary hotel game. Like, liminal space or whatever. Like, you could make one of those dumb little games that, you know, kids... Kids kids make these days, bro. If you play them, bro, you're a kid, okay? You're a little, little child. And we can, we can fill it up. <laughs> we can fill it up with, with um, water as well. Which is, is pretty dope. You know what I mean? There we go. Like that. So we, we now have our ocean. So I'll create. There we go. And look how beautiful that looks. Look at that. Isn't that just amazing? If 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 I if I play here right now, right? Let's let's see the experience, okay? Let's let's understand how good this terrain looks. Ooh, ooh, look at that. Okay, I'm not I'm not sure about that. But yeah, like look at that. You know, you have this whole huge map. And then you can start adding stuff to it, right? You can be like, oh yeah, I can add like, I don't know, some scary monster or something that chases people, right? But yeah, I guess I guess I guess that's that. Okay, and actually one more thing. One more thing. One more thing. What is this? Okay, what is generate? Import, you probably understand what import is. You, you have like a file for terrain and you can import the terrain. Generate is cool because it gives you another box. Okay, so you're going to be working with these boxes a lot. Okay, well not a lot. That's that's a little that's a little exaggeration, but you you know what I mean? Like you know there there are these boxes. So basically, you make this box as big as you want. The bigger it is, the longer it'll take. By the way, but if I I'll, I'll just make it a little smaller just so my my laptop doesn't explode, right? But if I make a box this big, okay, and then it asks me what biomes do I want? Do I want plains? Do I want hills? Do I want mountains? Do I want water? I want water. Okay, so I'll, I'll, I'll select water. And I want canyons as well. I don't want hills, honestly. Um, I do want dunes. I think dunes would be nice. Biome size, caves, seed, generate. And then as you can see, it's just going to start slowly generating terrain. Okay, it, it's all random too, by the way, right? Unless you have like a set seed in mind. Um, And yeah, and there we go. So now you have this fully randomly generated piece of terrain it's it's kind of like like minecraft world you know yeah and look 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 how cool that looks now you just have this ocean you have this ocean where you can like have fish and, and shit you know look at that beautiful now how how can you actually modify this okay very simple just workspace terrain here you can change whether the grass appears or not right so the, you see you see how cool the grass looks and then you remove it and it's just gone it looks flat like you i don't know i don't know what that what that even means okay but yeah so you got you got the grass keep grass on please bro just i don't i don't know why you would remove it it's don't don't remove it here's how you can change the material color so you know you can make your grass um i don't know more more cartoony i guess if you want like like i know a, a lot of like games nowadays they have their grass like this weird color where it's like it's almost blue um so you know if you want to make your game more lively i get you could change the color here water colors here you know you can make it brighter. Um, water transparency, you know, make water look like actual water, which I, th I think is I think is always fun. Yeah, like how how cool is it? You just, you can just make it pure black, right? Wet water reflectance, wave size, wave speed. You make fast water, you know. That looks that looks very very fun, very nice. Um, <laughs> part is like custom physical property, so you can like give stuff. I don't even know, bro. You can you can like make, give give them physics and everything, but yeah, that's kind of the idea of terrain. And you are able to modify this, so you're able to subtract from this. You're able to remove cubes of of stuff. Okay, so that that is that is something that you that you that you can do. Okay, and you can add as well. So you can remove, subtract, right? So even 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 though that is generated, that doesn't matter. You can still remove everything. Boom, meteorite. Okay, fire in the hole. 
or whatever whatever the kids are into these days you know and wow as you can see there actually it was lava here that's pretty cool so it's like a little, a little cave that we just destroyed there we go we just made a wasteland okay apocalypse rising 3.0 or whatever and then you remove that you clear that and it's all good um and yeah amazing so hopefully hopefully i'll upload the right file this time okay that's a little early reference um check the comments in the description for an amazing course that it's like i don't know 14 bucks i think i initially i i i made a course right and i'm like okay 40 dollars, okay because i spend like i don't know 30 hours on it i'm like 40 dollars fair price and then udemy just keeps putting it on sale for like 13 bucks you know so that's a little a little upsetting but you know you you make you make do <laughs> with 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 that so i'm gonna promote promote it a bit okay in like future videos just so more people know about it so yeah go check the comments check the description join the discord if you want to i don't know i don't benefit you know all up to you and we are back to basics thank you for watching